Clippers of Midtown Manhattan from high above the East River here in New York City. Hi, everyone. We're coming to you live. GA, it's all yours. Hey, Kevin. The Knicks have young talent and some promising draft picks. For that reason, they feel they're well positioned to trade for a star if one becomes available. The Knicks front office member described that as the best path for them. A little patience indeed. That's interesting. Thank you, David. Here's the starting group for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Garland and Sexton man the backcourt. Jared Allen is out there with Kevin Love. And it's Okoro in at the three side. And for New York, Barrett and Randall are in the forward. Whoa, oh, hammering it in! Oh. And sometimes it looks like for Garland, the game comes a bit easy, whether making plays for himself or others. And well, Garland, the fifth overall pick back in 2019, had a slow start to his career. But around the midway point, he, he really started to take off. And you wonder, Greg, in that rookie campaign, if that's a bit of somebody realizing the length of an NBA season. And maybe he made a bit of an adjustment in his body. Now in his second year, we can see some of the fruits of his labor in the offseason and him developing. And it's Rose with the ball for New York. Stolen by Okoro. Oh, and here we go. Coro's got it. The fast break chance. Clearly, he's one of the best there is in the business when it comes to making that lead pass. To the left wing. For three, Bullock. And Coro pulls it down. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early. And he's delivering. Well, he's going to just keep going now. That's early confidence for him. To the paint. Here's Bullock. Yes, and it's Rose with the assist that time. And that's the role they want for Rose. Getting guys going through his passing, especially when he can find them in ribbon. Right side, Sexton. Allen. Back to Sexton. From outside the arc, hands it from downtown. And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this lead. Pass to Gibson. Kicks it to Barrett. Over a Coro. Barrett, no good. The shot's there for him, and he's got to take it. I don't care if he doesn't convert. That's a shot he has to continue to take. Garland with the bucket. And that's another basket for him. They have really come out blazing here in the first. Rose looking around. And so it's Cleveland. Ahead by nine as the quarter comes to a close. And they've done a phenomenal... Recently, we had a chance to speak with R.J. Barrett about what was... I hate losing, but... And Barrett, a guy who's accustomed to winning, at least is an amateur grip. I mean, he won a championship in high school, could have won one in his only year of college. He's going to be a driving force for the organization to get better. And welcome back to the second quarter of action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. And from what you guys have seen so far from Cleveland, uh, well, what's your take? Well, in that first quarter, they, they were intent on just pounding the ball down low. And you don't see that all that often, getting down there and doing that much damage in a quarter. you got to respect the game plan. And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor, all fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. And New York, looking at who they've got, they've got Noel. He's out there with Robinson. Alec Burks is out there with R.J. Barrett. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. I uh, love the determination he showed there, getting himself into good position under the glass. With the presence of mind to know just where the rebound was going to come down. Well timed. New York moving it around. Burks for three. He can't get it to go. Cavaliers go the other way with it. Windler the pass to Osman. Another shot. It's rebounded by Barrett. Is it getting cold in here? This is, this is a tough one. Crucial that he starts to work a little harder for a higher percentage shot. Robinson left side. Overweight. And it's good off the back rim and in. 
Robinson's got his first points of the night. Robinson stretching his limits on that play from the mid-range. Two-second difference between shot clock and game clock. Garland with it, now guarded by Noel. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Free throw shooting, not an area he has worried about at all. How about last year, 88% from the line. And he knocks down the first one. Pretty exciting, the potential of Darius Garland. If he finds an offense that he can operate in and continue to be efficient, he's a guy that's going to keep improving. That one falls, so he hits both of them. And that's another area where he is just a superb player. Excellent at the free throw line. Burks finds Randall. Back to Burks. Launches it. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Okoro wide open. He fires. That'll do it for the first half. Cavaliers lead by 13. And, and now the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, welcome back to the NBA. It's Cleveland out on top at halftime. They have a 13-point lead. Shaq, how do you think Cleveland plays? You have to love how they're using their heads in a good ball movement. And that does it for our... And with the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. You look at Darius Garland. Guys, what a contribution. And guys, we saw just how tough he can be with the step to the rim. Great job of just attacking that first half. Yeah, nice job of carving his way to the inside with some ease. Not much resistance out there. On the court for Cleveland, Garland and Sexton man the backboard. Kevin Love out there with Jared Allen. And it's Okoro in at the three spot. And here's Rose outside. Drops in the tray. Rose has got his first three points of the game. Looking at current NBA players, Greg, leaving aside the real star players, who would you love to have played with from this era? Man, there are so many guys that, you know, and I hate to call them role players because they bring so much more to the table. But in reality, they got to fill some roles, right? And, you know, John Collins is a guy who's got great potential, a, a tremendous finisher around the, the rim. How about Robert Covington, a smooth shooter who, who defends his tail off. Davis Bertans, a, a deadly floor spacer who, who can put the ball down and, and create and make plays. So there's so many guys like that in the league that make a difference in determining whether your team can win or lose. Boy, those are three names I don't know that I would have mentioned, so I'm glad you did. And making the most of the screen, that's how it's done. And it's in the perfect spot, Greg. Frees him up to get all the way to the bucket. Really not enough help there. Lack of communication on the backside. Got that one, and the Cleveland lead has been cut down to just 10 points on the bucket from Derrick Rose. Now, here's Okoro. Derrick covering. Kicks it out to Love. And another three for Cleveland. Now that's how you get some payback. Love ready to get revenge after seeing them drain one on his squad. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. And here's Bullock from the arc. Knicks with a new 14. Pass to Rose. Bullock with it. Back to Rose. Down to five on the shot clock. Good on the triple. Rose has got 12 points here in the second half. Guys, he's been a one-man air raid coming at them time and time again. Kind of like he's in his living room right now. He's found a comfort zone. Once he gets that, the defense knows they're in trouble. And so it's the Cleveland Cavaliers with a 10-point lead. And it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist of the game. Uh, just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? Yeah, those are the kind of plays that you want to put on a canvas. Just beautiful basketball. Fourth quarter of action is upon us. Thanks, as always, for joining us. Robin is out there with Robinson. Then there's Alec Burks. Then there's Derek Rose. That's the five for New York right now. A lot of defenders choose to just 
back up off of him when he's in that tight. Try to avoid the and one. And this time, they're not backing off. The three. The shot off that time. Cavaliers go the other way with it. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. And Mitchell Robinson is going to pick up the foul. That'll be his second foul of the game. The rim-rattling two-handed jam. Uh, Nance is just such a cerebral player out there. Does a good job of trying to be a threat with the assist. New York moving it around. Burks kicks to Rose from deep. Here's Robinson, and there's two points. Working on the glass, paying off that time. And that's a lesson for the D. Fight harder on the glass. Yeah, you just can't afford to give up second chance opportunities again and again. And, and we'll just watch the clock wind down, guys, in what will turn out to be a win here for the Cavaliers. Tonight, they did a great job of getting everyone involved. They had the good passing, and that led to some open shots. Solid play, definitely, Kevin. And what a tremendous standout performance it was for Isaac Okoro. Just really loved his activity level here tonight. Constantly mixed it up, and he threw himself into a lot of plays. And the Knicks making a change here. Noel's checked in. And Cleveland with a change here, too. Garland's checked in. And here's Rose outside. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Outside, Sexton. The pass to Okoro. 34 seconds left in the fourth quarter. That's not going to make you a favorite target of your teammates. They'll think twice about feeding you if you're going to keep missing layups. Count it good. There's 25 seconds left in the game. Outside, Sexton. Here's Garland. There's 10 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. A nice shot by Okoro. And they came in determined to take this one. It's going to be a happy flight home. Yeah, when you step into an opposing team's arena and you can play with this type of composure, boy, that food tastes good on the way out of town. And so it's Cleveland taking care of business in this one. They came in here and took care of business like they were the home team. And, and Kevin, how about...